How many moons could Earth house? The main factor is having enough space for stable orbits. Let's break it down. One, a moon can't be too far away or it won't maintain a stable orbit around Earth. Two, it can't be too close or Earth's gravity will tear it apart. So, imagine a moon zone, a space where moons can safely orbit without interference. Each potential moon requires its moon zone and these zones can't overlap or the moons will disrupt each other's orbits. The more massive a moon is, the larger its personal space needs to be. According to simulations, Earth could potentially host up to seven moons, but this could have significant effects, such as more moons mean more complex and possibly higher tides. The gravitational pull and orbital dynamics of the moons could lead to changes in Earth's rotation and axial tilt, potentially affecting how we measure time. With multiple moons, we'd see more lunar eclipses and other celestial events, creating a mesmerizing sight in the night sky. However, more moons could also mean a greater chance of collisions with space debris, which could be more dangerous to Earth and its inhabitants. Now picture this. Three full moons casting intersecting shadows, briefly turning to dual eclipses before reverting to a brilliant triple moonlight. It's a surreal scene, isn't it?